Hello Youtubers, my name is Stephen Kirby um, This is my first video for my new channel which is just named after my name uh, and uh, today I'm going to show you as my first video I'm going to show you my uh, my folder of my drawings today because I um, I like to draw um, but obviously you probably want to know what kind of drawings they are and they are the very famous famous and favourite uh, manga drawings you know, the manga style I've been doing this for about, I've been drawing manga for about six or seven months, so it isn't really good, but it's um, what I've done so far. I just wanted to do it so I could show you guys my art, really. So this is the folder. This is the folder that I've got my artwork in. Uh, I did a spine for it a few days ago, because I didn't have one. You know, it just says my name. This is manga book one because I'm gonna I've got another folder because I'm running low on space for this. But let's get into it. Uh, the first drawing is uh, a, actually I quite a, what I quite like. It was my first drawing, one of my first drawings. Um, uh, these uh, I the first few I've just found pictures, sort of done uh, the same, sort of done all the outlines, but changed the colours and all that stuff and did it in my own way. So that's my first one. Uh, a lot of people like that one, at uh, my school at least. Uh, then I've got this one. Sorry about the light, if it reflects on the plastic of the, the thing that it keeps the paper in. It's a bit shiny. This one as well. I did the pen. I did the colouring and pencil a bit poorly, unfortunately, so I apologise for that. Right. Uh, this one here as well. Again, sorry if you, the pencil colouring is a bit p poor, but uh, again, it was like some of my first times, and I was a bit, was a bit off on it. That one as well. Uh, you're going to probably see me doing a lot of this uh, sort of outfit for the females. So I, I don't know what it's like. Some like a sailor, sort of a school outfit is what they call it. That one isn't, but it's uh, another sort of the same character as her, sort of the same person. Sorry about that, the shine. Uh, these are my sort of my, my sketches that I just ink and then leave. I was practicing the face structure. You can see the lines for where I've put the eyebrows and then I put the eyes and um, the circle of the scalp and all that stuff. Uh, so these ones are doing guide. I got, this is um, this is one I did freehand. Another freehand drawing that I did without using anything. I just did this off the top of my head. Uh, and this is a, a small little chibi, a devious chibi from a uh, a book. If you, uh, what well, I, I used a book, uh, I used a few books to help me get my drawing better. So I used a book from the guy Mark Crilly. You, if you haven't checked out his channel, go check it out. He uh, he does loads of videos. But this is one of the chibis that he had in his book. Uh, it's the devious emotion of the chibi, which is really fun. Uh, and then the, here are the sketches again, the, the just the ink drawings that I did with proportion things. A bit, off. I think the eyes are a bit off on that one. It was all right. This one's okay, but I, uh, one of the other drawing, I did a drawing on top of it, and the ink a little bit seeped through, so that's why it's a bit iffy. But it wasn't so bad that I couldn't put it in. And I got this one as well. This one's a bit bad, and I don't like these ones. Move on to the next ones because I don't really like them too. Uh, another one I did freehand. Uh, and off the top of my head, it's a bit off. I did I did the arms and hands poorly, but the rest of it I think I did all right. Uh, this here is a Mark Crilly tutorial on um, uh, the pose for two um, characters kissing, but this is the pose, not the, not the face. Uh, and these two these two next ones are also Mark Crilly. So you've got the the chibi surprise kiss with. I also added the writing that he put in at the end as well, so I decided to copy that. And the other one there, which was his first kissing video, his first manga tutorial on kissing, when it was just the face thing he focused on. So these two again are off the, uh, are off the top of my head, except for that one, that one's Mark Crilly again. Uh, so, so just this one. Um, so yeah, that's just a normal female. I put some... Yeah. I think I put some Japanese to it as well. I think I think that's a name, and that one there is like a a meaning. I think a sort of a description of a person. One of the lines was a bit off on the arm. I inked. 
Now these two are just pencils. I did the Innocent Girl tutorial from Mark Crilly again. I don't know a fair few of these are from Mark Crilly, so I apologise if uh, you haven't seen much original. But you will start to see my better ones in the next few folders. The things you got this one. I think I'd, I think I did a video tutorial off someone else. I can't remember it, but if the, if that person sees this video, uh, yeah, I'm not taking credit for this. This is still just a tutorial from you, and I thank you for it. With these two off the top of my head, this is a sort of a little comic strip I did rough. Uh, I just decided to see what it looked like to do a small little comic strip. It's nothing big. I'm not going into it or anything. No, I didn't do it on computer. I just did a quick scene of sort of a guy waking up. So I've got the shadow of my, my phone doing this on my phone. The shadow. And uh, I sort of did a little one where a guy wakes up and he's late and all that stuff. It's a bit bad. This here I did. Uh, this image here I did sort of with a bit more detail of the pencil, the pencil colouring. And it's too. I did it when I was listening to some nightcore music because for some reason nightcore, nightcore music on YouTube always is it always is listened and played to while displaying some kind of image of some manga character or an anime character. And I decided to do my own sort of random one and finally got some dates where I did these. Moving on to the better ones now, actually. So that was done with charcoal. That's really crap. Leave that one out of the way. Uh, this one was one of my better ones that I did recently. I did that on the fifteenth. Yep. Uh, so I did. I did a hair. I think I did a hair and a face proportions quite better than I did than I did last time. I don't know if I did the arms off a bit. Then I did this uh, guy here standing next to her, which is he's, he's pretty lanky, <laughs> but I just made him up. Now this pit is just paid, but the, here, here I, I did my first drawing and shadow first drawing and colouring with Copic markers so I bought I bought some markers from my nearest shop and uh, I did this start off drawing here on the 18th and now we get some of my favourite ones now these two I've done recently and they are really I'm really proud of them so I've got this one here which I'm very proud of as well again I'm done with markers and I did another uh, one that my friend actually uh, suggested I did. My friend, uh, he's actually he's actually his channel his channel is the Sponzo. You want to check it out? He does guitar and gaming and sometimes and stuff like that. But um, uh, this um, Spencer suggested I do another one of these kissing drawings because apparently I'm really good at them. And so I did sort of um, I don't know why I did grey hair. I thought it was I guess the only the pet sort of the time I thought I wanted to do it with grey hair. And uh, I did the eye. I think I did the eye a bit better that time. Yeah. Uh, this one's actually inspired by a Nightcore uh, image that I saw when I was listening to a Nightcore song, Angel with a Shotgun, I think it's called. And uh, I did uh, I did this sort of image with that sort of same picture, but I changed the character's look, and obviously the shape of the wing is really shit. So it sort of it sort of displays how a person may look innocent and look well, not evil, and then might have an evil personality to them. Different ones, so sort of displays that. This one I really am not really happy with. I uh, I did the I did the fe I did a head shape uh, way too big compared to his, and her arms are freaking puny, so I hate that. Uh, and these ones are recent. That's my that's my profile uh, photo that I did. I decided to do that. This is profile photo. The one I've done today, uh, and I'm really proud of, is this one here. It's just a random thing guy I made up. I, I made up like, this guy who's uh, sort of really devilish. Sort of really sort of evil, and he's got uh, these wings and stuff like that. And yeah, so uh, I, I'm thinking if I ever get on to doing my own manga when I'm older and better, I think this guy is going to be definitely involved in one of them. But I think that's about it. Yeah. So um, now that was, there were all my drawings um, from when I started to now. Uh, I will have more drawings in the in the near future, maybe a few time lapse drawings to post on my channel because I really want to do more of these videos. Uh, and I will probably do another uh, collection drawing of my newest ones in a future time, maybe in a few more months when I've got a lot more to show. This video is getting quite long now, I better cut it off quick. Um, so, uh, I do have one video of, a, of me doing a time lapse, but it's not on my channel, it's on the Spunza channel. My friend Spencer, uh, his channel is called The Sponsor, yeah. So type that in, check it out. Uh, it's it's me doing a drawing of death or like the Grim Reaper. Um, it's it was it was all right, but I could, obviously I think I could have done better because at the time it, my schedule was a little rusty. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, I've been Stephen. Uh, uh, <laughs> stay tuned for the next video. Thank you.